Guitar chefs. After reading your comments on my videos, it's come to my attention that some of you want me to play bass. But I am sorry to tell you that I am not a bass player. I mean, you really should have seen this coming considering there were already a hundred guitar videos on my channel before you got here. But you'll be pleased to know that even though my primary instrument is guitar, I've played many gigs as a bassist for real Canadian dollars. I hope that you can find it in your heart to forgive me. It's also come to my attention that you actually haven't heard me play anything on guitar because we've been talking about my microwave for the past week. But speaking of my microwave, it's actually no longer in the place that I show you. It's now a few inches to the right because my roommate moved out and took the bookshelf that used to be here with him. He also took the table. Guess I'll be eating on the floor for the next two weeks. I'm pissed off about it, but I'm not even mad. In other news, the amount of likes on my videos has been ridiculously high when compared to the amount of views. A really good like to view ratio would be about 10%. To find this ratio, just take the amount of likes on a video, divide it by the amount of views, and multiply it by 100. It's fucking easy, mate! It's actually quite difficult to do better than 10%. And generally, the more views a video has, the lower the ratio will be. My last two videos have surprisingly been over 20%. Pretty decent, right? Unacceptable! I will settle for nothing less than 200%. I should have twice as many likes on my videos as I do views. If this video has any less than that, I will be canceling the internet. So you see that like button? I want you to fuck it up. See that dislike button? Neither do I. I play guitar now for you. Did you like that chord progression? I wrote it myself. Fun fact, every song you've ever heard in your life was written by me, except the bad ones. I'll be showing you four more chord progressions throughout this video, all of which were written by me. It's your job to rank them, so make sure you do that. Otherwise, I'll be canceling air. No more air. Do you really want to live under the sea? Then rank the fucking chord progressions. In terms of difficulty, my crystal chord progression takes the number one spot. My reflection chord progression would be number two. But let's slow things down a bit for this next chord progression. This is called For the Odds, and it's the easiest on the list to play. Bonus points if you can figure out what key it's in, because I will not be telling you this time. Do you know what key it's in? Key reveal at the end of this video. There's also a funny story as to why I named that tune for the odds. Next chord progression.
While not the easiest to play on the list, this chord progression is the most harmonically simple. The chords are more basic than a college girl doing homework on her MacBook Air at a Starbucks. The final chord progression is upbeat and has never been posted on social media until now. Did you like that chord progression? Fuck the like button if you did! Take a few moments to watch them again before you rank them in the comments. I'll wait. While you do that, I'd like to take this time to talk about the sponsor of this video. You know who the sponsor of this video is? 52 Week Guitar Player. You know who made that program? I did! I am the sponsor! If you're interested in the program, Book a call with me. Don't book one if you're poor. Nah, but seriously, somebody booked one the other day and they wrote on their application that if the program costs money not to call them. <sighs> I never called them. Now that you've written out your rankings for each chord progression in the comments, I can reveal to you the key for the odds. It's fucking A major. It starts on the four chord, which is a rootless D major seven sharp 11. We then do a two, five, one to our root, which is A major seven. Then we jump down to our sixth chord, which is F sharp minor. I'm adding a nine to it because sex. Final chord of the progression is our three chord. C sharp minor 11. By the way, I'm doing a secondary microwave reveal at 100,000 subscribers. I can't technically do the new microwave reveal until February 1st because that's when I'll be moved in. Now, it's reading your comments on my videos time. Davey, Slappers, Charles, Tappers, Brandon, Fulkers. I don't actually call you guys Fulkers. That is kind of funny though. Your catchphrase should be, Fuck the like button. Good idea. Who the fuck are the people that disliked? How disrespectful. Dictionary of Brandon. Fuck. Verb. Not a swear word. That's good enough for me. How will Davey react when he knows this channel isn't about bass? SMH. I think he already knew before he gave me the show. Do you sleep in your closet? Yes. No. I need the answer. No. The 10 people who dislike this don't like my microwave. The 10 people who dislike this. Or wait. The 10 people who disliked doesn't like your microwave. Making me make typos and shit. Reading typos and shit. Where is the OMG at the end? I will call the police, I am Sri. There is no OMG. That's Davey504's catchphrase. This guy was an undiscovered talent waiting to be found. Fucking right. Don't subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to Davey504.